What's really good guys, welcome back to another episode. It's me as two with that I'm me. Welcome back to another episode. Uh, I have this 2006 Hyundai Sonata. I, I'm gonna show you how to replace the alternator. Alright. I'm gonna do the, uh, the timing belt. Timing belt. Serpentine belt too. That guy up right there. Okay. We have a few connectors. I have this one right here. I think I did this video before. I don't know. But I'm gonna do it again. Just for. We got that nut. What is that? Like a 12 millimeter. How about the connector here? Alright. Before I get into the action, please. Before I get into the action, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Do that for me. Support the channel. Hit the like button. Share this video and the feedback. Put in the comment box. Uh, anything you need to say, put in the comment box for me. Uh, don't forget to leave the tip. Of, uh, leave the tip on the table. You know what I'm saying. The other way you can uh, help me out is by uh, uh, watch the whole ad. Okay, that's how you can uh, support the channel. Watch the whole ad, don't don't skip it. Do that for me, I would appreciate it. Okay. Since you're getting this video for free. Anyway, alright, let's get it. Stool. Some nuts here, bowl here, bowl here. Well that, this one is missing though. And another nut here. Okay. Those are gonna be 10 millimeter. Then we're gonna remove this guy. Probably gonna have to remove these holes too. Let's get it. Remove this. Now we're gonna remove the belt though. All you gotta do is grab a, a pry bar like this, put it right here. And push it or oh, pry. Like that. Just be careful though when you do this. Huh? Now you can remove that the belt. I grab this. I'm gonna remove this clamp. Be careful if uh, the engine is hot. Put it down there though. Don't forget to put a bucket down there. All right. I'm going to put it to the side. Now before you start touching the alternator. You gotta disconnect one of these guys. The battery. Okay, so you don't. This is the ground. I'm gonna put it away. Alright, that's good. Now you can touch the alternator. I'm gonna remove this bracket. There's two things, one here, one here. I'm gonna remove this bracket. So you see these clips? We're gonna pop those. So these wires, oh here, pop this too. Okay, that's another clip over there. You don't want to do all that. Press this guy right here. Press and pull it so you disconnect this guy. All right. But you know what? You don't have to deal with this shit. Right? Just 
put it to the, put it to the side just like that. You don't need to disconnect this. Uh, just put it to the side. It will be good if you hit this with a tent. So you have more space here. Pop this one. 10 millimeter here. So you put it to the side and have more space here. All right. So I pop this one. Pop this one. All right. I didn't need to remove this. Okay. Now I have like what is this? 13. And the other one is right here. That's the other bolt. Okay. So I'm gonna do this one first. It's gonna be 14. Alright, the one at the bottom is 14 too. Right. To make it easier to reach the uh, the bowl at the bottom, you can remove this guy. This is gonna be 14, this one. Right there. All right. This is a new guy. That's part number. This is a new guy. Make sure he turns the pulley. Kia Hyundai, huh? Don't forget this connector. This one look a little bit different though. Doesn't it? Removing the bolts now. It the same size. Now you gotta do is pry it like so. So see, right now I'm gonna need some space here. So, I'm gonna try to remove it without removing the fan. If I can, I'm gonna remove the fan. Uh, pretty much. Okay, I have to disconnect this guy. Uh, all you gotta do is this silver thing, push it back, and then this clip or whatever, just push it down, and then pull it. I have a little bit more space here. We'll see, we'll see what we can do here. I'll let you know. Alright, this guy's gonna be really tight to push that way. Okay, so you're gonna do is pry it this way. So you can push a little the uh, AC line, okay? Just a little bit though. And then once you push it enough, a little bit. Don't forget the connector here, okay? Uh, just gotta squeeze it. Just uh, squeeze it. What is it? Where's that guy? Should be around there, you know. That's, that's not uh, my concern. This is the thing right here. So this guy. Don't pull it out yet though, you're just gonna like push it outward so you push the line, this line right here, out. 
once you do that now pull it like this okay the alternator but don't pull it out yet though because you're gonna have to remove the, the fin I'm gonna do this car. This car, this car, this car. I'm just gonna remove it. Be careful with this. Now I put this thing right there so you hold it. I want to remove the three clips like that. Use a Philip, then pry it out with this guard. Hit this guy right here, 10 millimeter. This might be a uh, 8 millimeter, 8 millimeter, another 10 millimeter. Disconnect this guy, okay. If you can squeeze it here, uh, just press on WD 40 so it's easier, or just pick it through there. pick it through there and then you're gonna be able to disconnect it and then we'll just pull it up okay that's what we're gonna do now so okay I'll move this this one right here oh, I need to remove this this is just like a cover but you see that guy right here that's like a clip push it out so you free the fan over here too. You see this guy? Okay, and then lift it, lift the fan, and it's good to go. Come out. This was gonna easy though. That's good to come out. Focus over there, holding it. All the holes. So now you have more space, I'm gonna have to use my both hands. One, because it's heavy, and two, it's greasy, and I don't wanna drop it and ruin the radiator. All right. So now you have more space to pull it out. Know what I'm saying? Rotate it, turn it, flip it, you know, to pull it out. There you go. Obviously, that's a good one. That's a whole one. All right, so I removed the fan. Now you're gonna have to like uh, remove the bolt that I hold the uh, dipstick. Know what I'm saying there's a bolt right here. It's 12 millimeter, so you can have uh, more chances. Know what I'm saying a little bit more space to uh, remove the alternator. Pretty much it. Now you just gotta put back the new one, install the new one, and everything goes in reverse. All right? If you have any questions, just let me know. Put in the comment box for me. All right? Don't forget to support the channel. Support the channel. Do that for me. Do that for the channel. Uh, me. Subscribe to the channel. Like this video. Share this video. Like I said, the feedback. Put in the comment box. All right? Oh, and uh, don't forget to uh, leave the tip on the table. All right? The other way you can help support the channel is by uh, watch the whole ad, okay? Watch the whole ad, don't skip it. That will help a lot, all right? And I would, I'm just gonna leave it right here. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Hala at your boy. That's I'm out. See ya.